Hi again everybody, thanks for tuning in. Today I'm going to show you my new tool that I picked up from uh, the good folks at Harbor Freight Tools. This is the Centec Infrared Thermometer. It's got a Class 2 laser targeting system. Uh, it's got an LCD with a uh, backlighting display. The temperature range is negative 36 Fahrenheit up to 968 degrees Fahrenheit, so almost a thousand. Accuracy is uh, uh, plus or minus two percent above 32 degrees or plus or minus four and a half percent below 31. It's got a laser uh, that's professional quality class two that'll help you aim so you know what you're actually uh, taking the temperature of. One second response time and it shuts itself off in 15 seconds. You can recall the last temperature and it's got a low battery indicator and uh, a non-slip pistol grip. And to run this you only need two AA batteries. So we'll go ahead and Open this up and I'll try it on certain things around the house, see how it works out. Okay everybody, I got this out of the plastic clamshell. This is the Centec Infrared Thermometer using two AAA batteries. The way to get the batteries, you just take the hand grip here, pinch it and slide down. And that exposes two AAA batteries that aren't included with the purchase. And all you have to do is install those and you're ready to go. And uh, let's see if we can see the, the nice, it's real clear to me. But I'll try to zoom in so you guys can see the display. Okay, it's uh, 63 degrees. You have a Celsius and a Fahrenheit button right there. And when you pull the trigger, you see the laser pointer. So that's a lot of fun if you have a cat, but it actually just helps you pinpoint the aim of what you're looking at. Okay, here we are up in the kitchen. I'm going to do the stove test with the uh, laser okay. infrared thermometer. What I'm going to do is turn on the front burner. Okay, it's on. We'll try to get that to catch up. There it goes, heating up. All I have to do is keep the uh, trigger down and the laser button or the laser centered on the grate. About 10 seconds or at 200 degrees. I'm moving it around different spots on the uh, on the burner. Pretty cool. Now I'm going to get an ice pack out of the freezer and set it next to it and we'll go the other way. Okay, I just showed you the infrared thermometer with a heat source and I'm going to show you how it works on an ice pack. So I'll try to get the uh, backlit display to show up properly. Little focus noise here. 12 degrees. I'll zoom on over to the surface, 64, and then back to that. 